Well, tonight I was invited down to a housing seminar at the Lake Oak Street Theatre at Gosford North. This was being held by the University of Newcastle and the keynote speaker was Robin Parker. Now, I haven't seen Robin Parker for years since she resigned at the end of 2014 after 12 years as the state Liberal MP for Maitland. Now, she reckons she's a coastie. Anyway, she didn't go down real well. This was far more interesting a night than I thought. So we are working together. So 30% social and affordable housing. I've even heard large developers like Ned Lease last week talk about their objectives to have 30% of their housing, social and affordable housing. Um, affordable housing, there is a definition for affordable housing. I'm glad you asked. Um, affordable housing is for those people who are key workers, those people who are unable to pay market rent, um, who perhaps need housing closer to where they work, housing closer to train lines, housing closer and better located to the infrastructure that they need. Well, it seems like Robin Parker thinks that affordable housing is for workers, like essential workers who need to get trains. It certainly, it certainly, it certainly works for a, for a great... Some of you don't want to see any change at all. Some of you don't want to see any change, but yet you still want to see people housed. We must have some change in terms of our mix and our diversity if we want to house the people who are so desperately in need of housing on the Central Coast and who will in the future. Now, see what she's doing there. It's a nasty trick. She's trying to make the audience look like pariahs who won't accept any change whatsoever. It doesn't mean we need high density development everywhere. It does mean we need targeted density and development. It does mean a diversification of housing. And it does mean um, we can grow and thrive with the right infrastructure. I feel positive about it. I hope you do. <laughs> We go back to these young people. They feel positive. They're looking forward to the future. We're planning for them. And I feel with the heads, the people we've got in the room, I'm looking forward to... I can't hear you. Sorry. We're looking forward to your questions to the panel. Um, we're looking forward to your feedback. This is... We're trying to create a future for the Central Coast. We're looking forward to your measured contribution. That's how you can get in touch with the Six Cities Commission. Um, we're looking forward to your feedback rather than yelling. Let's get some intelligent debate about how we can house people right across the Central Coast. Thank you very much, Robert. Thank you speech near outline of what the Greater Cities Commission is oh. going to do. Look, please, um, people that have come here tonight and are speaking here are doing it of their own free will. This is this is a university event. It's not, it's not a council event. So we need to be, be respectful. Okay? We will have a and a opportunity for the audience, but you need to respect the fact that this, is, this will run in a certain uh, order. So if I could just ask people to uh, do that. We're going to introduce the panel now. About 45 seconds later. Right, look, I think we, I think we just have to call a halt to this. So look, I thank you for your, thank you for your attendance tonight. Uh, but, but this is not an open forum. We just can't run it in this way, so I'm sorry about that. This is not this is not a council meeting. It's a university. It's a university event. Okay. So look, thank you very much for your attendance. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. If you could please make your way out of the audience. Thank you. And so we all went home. Of course, it would have been better on Robin Parker if she had actually said something. She spoke for 15 minutes and did not convey any information 
whatsoever. And then when she mentioned council, she seemed to forget that Central Coast doesn't actually have any councillors and won't have for at least another year. I really feel for any people who've driven from, say, Lake Mamora or your minor 